I think it's time I show you how to use music video transitions the right way. MTC Beat. showing you at least three different ways you can apply your presets today. The first way is using adjustment layers. Once created, just drag your adjustment layer on top of your clip. Once you have that on your timeline, you want to look for the cut between both clips. Now, most people overlook this step, but most presets are going to be anywhere between 10 and 20 frames. To find your frames, you can hit the left or right arrow keys on your keyboard. This will take you back single frames, so you can just hold shift, hit the keys, and it'll take you back five frames each time. So I'm going to take 10 frames off of each side of the clips. Now you can add your preset, and it should look like this. Just a reminder that all of the presets I'm using is going to be linked down below. Be sure to check it out. So the next way you can add a preset is simply by dragging it onto the clip itself and I'm going to show you that. Here we have an example of where you can drag and drop a preset directly onto the clip. This preset is called Airborne. Let me show you this. The third way is by stacking your transitions and not every transition is going to work this way but you can try them with mines. I've created them so they work like back to back. You can drop them and you know they complement the next one but you can also do that and create a seamless transition at the same time. It should look like this. That was about three to four transitions just now. So there you have it, three different ways that you can apply presets to your music videos today. Be sure to check out my transition pack, it will be linked down below and stay tuned for more.